G'day, welcome to Chalk Cine Control, I'm Chris Chalk. Today I'd like to tell you about View and Test, one of my favourite features in the Natron line of Ethernet to DMX gateways by Obsidian Control Systems. Having these tools built into the devices saves me time on set. Netron nodes come packed with a great range of standard features, mains or PoE power, a great web-based user interface, and on the back you'll find two locking RJ45 connectors with built-in gigabit switches. This means you can daisy chain up to 10 Netron devices together without having to use additional external network switches. Normally, you'd test DMX output from a node with a variety of DMX testers like Chauvet's rdm to go or City Theatrical's DMX Cat. With Netron, you don't necessarily need those tools because the tools are built into the device itself. To display this, I'm going to trigger a rainbow wave test queue built into my show file. If we look at our 2D plan, we can see a whole bunch of fixtures are doing an offset rainbow color chase. If we go into our DMX in out screen, we can then see what data is being output by each universe. There are many reasons you might want to check if your node is receiving the correct DMX data but the Netron software makes it easy. The first thing to do is to push the encoder wheel, which will take you to the main menu. Scroll down to view and test and click the encoder wheel again. You can choose between DMX Artnet or streaming ACN view or DMX port test. Scroll to your chosen view and press the encoder wheel. In DMX view, you'll select which port you want to view. You can select and adjust the channel range and then Scroll down to Start Monitor and press the encoder wheel to begin the test. Once you're in test mode, you can use the encoder wheel to scroll through the range of values. Within the DMX monitor, there are three different views you can use to monitor incoming DMX data. To change your view, simply click the encoder wheel and scroll to your desired view. DMX Grid, DMX Line, or DMX Address. DMX port tests allows you to test any output port in your node independently from incoming network data. Simply scroll down to DMX port test, select the port you wish to test, set your speed and your desired range and plug in your chosen DMX tester. You'll see that the node is generating its own signal to test the port. As soon as you back out of test mode using the back button, the selected port will go back to transmitting its programmed DMX universe. So, that's view and test in Netron. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, like and subscribe, and feel free to leave a comment or ask any questions. As always, for more info, check out www.chalkcinecontrol.com. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.